hexagon jo clue. Fiona. Giant. Headlights. <laughs> Screamers. <laughs> Modification. <laughs> Madam C and welcome to Brown's House for Ford Power Live. I'm in my Ford Street KA which is parked behind me and I've already filmed some arrivals so make sure you check that video out if you haven't already. But we have even more arrivals still pulling in, some later arrivals to the show including a lot of Mustangs. That's like a camo green, it's only a subtle colour that wasn't grey. There were a lot of retro fours, it wasn't just Focuses and Fiestas. But as I'm sure you can imagine there were quite a few of Focuses and Fiestas five-cylinder noises, turbo noises, etc. There's even a red Escort Cosworth. So the first Ford of the show is a 6610 Tractor. Not going to be doing any skids with those tyres. The Weasleys have a presence too, a large lineup of Anglias. But I've arrived straight at an influencer section, of which I'm not part of because I don't own a Ford. This Ford is a well-known car because it's a ZTEC with an ST lump. This has been a huge project and it is on display with the insta famous section of cars we've got the pink transit we've got georgie's focus rs mark one and a nitrous blue mark ii focus rs and then rich is absolutely crazy mark ii next door further on in the main section of the show we have the largest lineup of escorts with a capri in the middle that i have seen mark one's mark twos a few mark threes we have higher boosters we've got duratec sts there's cosworth engines we've got twin webbers we've got turbos we've got straight cut gear We've got all sorts of variants of the Escorts, the Anglias, the Cortinas, the Retro Bunch. They all arrive together. There you go, Turbos, Duratec, ST, and a Mark II who's facing the wrong way. Take this Mark II for an example. Cosworth block with a turbo and a screamer and evidence of its previous antics on its way into the show. Also, the exhausts are integrated into the rear end of the car. I'm trying to film them without showing the number plates. And he is part next to a friend of his with a turbo turboed VTEC lump again with a screamer out the side. And today I've been invited along by Greenlight Insurance. I could have parked my car here but it is a Nissan, it's not really a street KA so they've got a Mustang and then there's a few focuses nearby. There's actually a Porsche 911 unusually. But you now draw me all the way down in the paddock area because we found another Escort Cosworth white with white wheels. He is white wheeling in the world. And here's my favourite Capri of the day. I've never been a keen fan of them but it's got of V8, the engine they always should have had, so this one is a proper race car. And we have more race cars further down, including this Focus, with a number plate. So I've done a plate check, and it comes up as a Ford Focus ZTEC, so either this is road registered, or he's got another one with those plates and he's put those on it to confuse people. But another surprise of the day, we've got a GT40 recreation, and a Lancia Stratos recreation. But we're venturing back up to normality where most of the cars are, we've got the brave wheels on the Fiesta, Union Drac to celebrate the Queen's life. We've got one of many, many Focus SCs. White wheels and a bat holding up the bonnet. But if you don't want white for your wheels, you could always go for every single other colour. So the grey wheels with RGB sparkle in them, even the calipers have sparkle in them. And then we have multiple colours on the Mondeo wheels as well. And on the other side we've got green and purple to match the hexagons around that half of the car. And further up we have the biggest fan of Cadbury's Dairy Milk on his white wheels. He has a sparkly Cadbury's logo and under the bonnets we've got Cadbury's Dairy Milk and the Gorilla. Also look, the dipstick is a bar of chocolate. There's even a Ford Galaxy slash S Max slash C Max section. This one likes drifting, this one has a siren on top, this one's called Fiona. There is even a Mondeo section. This particular one has the Hulk airbrushed on the side of it. I think there's a Hulk collage on the bonnet and then sparkly and flashy lights under the bonnet of the estate. Next is the Puma Owners Club which at the front has a Ford Puma front end on an Escort van. The Fords seem to find some of the most visual mods compared to others. It's got a giant orange SD badge replacing the Ford logo and white is the colour of choice for the details. The one at Scoop is Ritter and the Archers. Could we say he's white reading the world? I suppose we'll let that happen. There's also a Texaco ST. This one is an ST as opposed to the ZTEC that's been made into an ST, but it's in the same livery, even with a mini me Sierra Cosworth on its dash. And of course, being a Ford show, revolutions have begun. We have a Fiat. Oh, he stops. There we go. The Fiesta is providing the content. And perhaps 
that's the award for the bravest wheels of the day. I, I actually really like these. It's a pearlescent chrome blue. But behind we have an Escort Cabriolet with golf headlights. I think there's some Subaru elements to it as well. They like their colours here. They like their stickers too. And they like their mascots. And we next approach this Fiesta with an RS badge on the back of it. And as you'll come around, you can see it is an RS engine. There's an Escort van as well with a screamer just next door to this character. It's got side pipes too. There is a Lamborghini. This ST is mad. We have even more GT40s with a Cobra neighboring them. This is a Crendon recreation. It's got the proper knockoff spinner Halley brand wheels, the proper Ford V8, black interior as it should, a Carroll Shelby autograph. And a Kukuraka horn. There's a satin grey Mark II Focus, which I can only presume is on air ride. It's got a tiny, tiny RS badge. What? Oh, I see. I was about to film the police car over here, and there's a police car over there. Oh, look, it's our late majesty, the Queen Elizabeth II. So, that was the Ford Power live show at Brands Hatch. And I've headed on to Car Calendar, which is this video's sponsor, and that's how you can find out about events in your area, anything from car meetings to shows. And I found a car meet that's on tonight. So I'm going to head there to Beaconsfield Services for the Fuel Junkies meet. So we'll see you in a bit. to buy this car four grand and it's yours genuinely no five mm, make me an offer four four and a half six oh and there's oh nando should we have a nando there's a spoons spoons to the american audience basically spoons is an establishment in which you very rarely use a spoon where's the rest of the cars can you, can you look at all these people enjoying a nice uh um, nice we can have a nando's before the cars get here because yeah. there's no cars here yet well well we were oh well, the car meet's normally where those lorries are. But it's obviously not. So because they've blocked off what's over there, we're going to move the meat over here. There's a Renault McGann with a homemade rear screen. Modification. Okie dokie. Oh, there's a chaser! So it's a black JZX100 with some yellow... Oh no, wait. Uh, there it is. It's a black JZX100. Well, I actually cleaned my car for once. My wheels are actually whitish. So, M4, 350Z, Subaru Subaru 370Z. We've got an RX-8 over there. And a stripped out Peugeot. And a Saxo. And a Pistachio, because the colour. And the JZX100 Toyota Chaser. There was a Mark 1 Focus RS cruising by behind the S14 and the R33. So apparently there's some filming going on down the road and that's why they've commandeered that part of the car park that we normally park at so a few people have turned up and then left so we don't really know what's going to happen so we're going to have food and then catch up with you once it's probably dark so we didn't go for nando's i've got some sick and chloe's got some moldy fish what have we got in store or in car park all i can hear is subarus that's not a that's a subaru into the night. I found a race car. Now, last time we were here, we were in the green light Focus ST. We have another Focus ST, a Mark III. The Subaru's found a space and someone's playing music. And we have a T5R, adding to the yellow collection of the night. Oh, look, we've started a revolution competition. We've got another yellow car, the Gulf. There's a Subaru behind. The S3 was doing launch controls. <laughs> GA3 has turned up as well, looking bright pink in the night. So whilst that's going on, the Subarus that we drove with are still revving together. We have a JZX100 Toyota Mark II, not a chaser. E36 times 2 Subarus are trying to flame, I think. Bring Neil's back! Oh, I think Carl 
Thanks. It's good. But that was pretty much that from a small meet at Beaconsfield service. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Go follow me on all my social channels for the updates, highlights, and photos I take at these meets. But for now, thanks for watching.